Hello. Hi. I haven't vlogged in like a week and a half, so I was like, I gotta get vlogging. Um, hi, if you're new here, if this is the first video you're seeing, my name is Neve. I'm 25. I don't know why I felt the need to include my age there, but I'm 25. And I live in Vancouver, because I moved here from Ireland. And I just vlog my life. Welcome to me. <laughs> Why am I gone so weird? I was literally about to be like, I promise I'm not always this weird and awkward in my videos. Yes, I am. That is like half of my brand, weird and awkward. Anyway, I am just back from an interview that I think went well. I find it hard to gauge these things. Like, I went to one, I had one on Monday, which was honestly just kind of weird overall. I don't really mind if I don't get it. I think I did a good interview, but like I couldn't tell what they were, I don't know, it was just, it was just weird. But today, I thought went well. Um, so he said he'd let me know if they, like he's gonna have a look at what kind of roles they have for me. It's in a restaurant, by the way. Um, but he said he'd look at what roles he has for me, get back on to me if he feels he has something for me. So I don't know. And then I have another interview tomorrow with another restaurant. So exciting, I really need to get a job because I just need some money coming in. Like I'm not panicked, but you know, we just need a bit of income, don't we? Um, this is my outfit. So I have this top that I got in pennies years ago, like years ago. And then these pants are from Zara. If you watched one of my previous vlogs, you will have seen them. And then I just wore these boots, which I got from Old Navy. And they're actually ideal, they have fluff. I wore fluffy socks. I always wear fluffy socks if I'm wearing boots. It's just who I am, okay? But, can I put you there? No. 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 <laughs> um, now I am just gonna throw my hair up into a bun because I'm freaking sweating. It's still warm here. Like, it's 20 degrees today. <sighs> I'm honestly so ready for winter. I'm like, let's just, please, can we have some colder weather, you know? Um. Oh my god, I need to get changed. What am I even doing with my hair? Okay, I'm gonna just like sort out my hair and get it changed and then I'll talk to you again. Okay, we're back. I don't really know what this lighting is. That's turning. Anyway, I'll change into a comfy t-shirt and shorts and I'm gonna make myself a coffee because I think I deserve one. And I'm gonna watch, I think there's an episode, what day is it? Wednesday, I know, Kardashians is tomorrow, but I think I have an episode of Reboot to watch. Um, it's on Disney Plus for Canada anyway, apologies if you're watching in Ireland, it's not on your Disney Plus. It's on mine though, <laughs> um, but it's really good. It's like something, it's just like very chilled TV show, you know, you don't have to like do much thinking when you're watching it, which are the TV shows I really like. But I'm gonna make my coffee. We got these, I got these like, tins for us um in dollarama it's like deals um because we've had a problem with ants so i just got these to keep the coffee concealed in them this is our coffee machine and i honestly love it so freaking much i am obsessed with it it is so simple to use i will leave a link to it down below i would recommend investing in this because it is so worth it and it is so easy to use so yeah Let's turn on, look at our cute little picture. Aww, how cute. Anyway, I'm gonna turn on the TV and just chill out for a little while. Hello, it is the next day now. I have another interview at one o'clock. It's like just gone after 12. Um, and I picked out this outfit the other night, forgetting that I, always struggle to close the buttons on top like they're so delicate and like i'm like fuck <laughs> so i put out the camera because maybe me talking away will just like help me get it sorted even if i could maybe just close the top one or something would that do oh oh <gasps> oh okay okay i only have one of the buttons closed right now can i would it be easier to try to close the second one they're so small, I don't think you'd notice if it was only... I don't think I'm going to be able to get that one right now. Of course, I wore this when there was no one at home today, everyone's working. Ugh. 
Did I get it? No. Did I? No. Did I? Did I? Did I? <laughs> I'm not too sure. Wait, no. Let me go into my room and just double check that this looks okay. Oh my god, we did it! Did I close the two buttons? Go me! Um, perfect. Okay, crisis averted. Um, yeah, have another interview today for another restaurant. I'm not as nervous for today's one. I kind of just want to get it over with and I want someone to offer me a job this week. Like, I've had three this week. Um, so I'm like, please, just one of you guys hire me. That would be great. Um, so yeah, it's quarter past 12. I'm going to leave here about 20 to 1. I think it only takes me like 15 minutes to walk there. Um, and I'm always too early and I'm just standing outside like an idiot. Um, so I'm gonna try not even insanely early. Of course, I'm gonna be ready earlier than I need to be, but that's just who I am as a person. I am early to things. I'm never really on time, I don't do late. So I'm always early to things, which I think is a good way to be, but I need to finish off fixing my hair, put on some pants, cause you know, can't rock up in these. Um, but yeah, I'll show you this outfit. I look very professional then, but they did tell me to dress professionally. So yeah, okay, I'm gonna finish getting ready now. Do you wanna stop doing that flashing thing? There we go. Here is the full outfit that I'm wearing. Um, I have no idea where I got this top. It is years old, like the one I had yesterday. Basically, any of the shirts I own are so old because I haven't been wearing like shirts or anything for work in the past three years. So they're all super, super old. Got these pants in Zara and shoes are old navy. So yeah, gonna start heading like 10-ish minutes maybe. Um, I just need to put on some lip gloss from my glasses, make sure I have everything in my bag and then we are good to go. And I don't know what I'm gonna do afterwards. I'm gonna need to have lunch at some point. I don't think I have anything here. I'm not sure. I also, I'm just tempted to just go like look around the shops. Like I don't need anything, but I'm kind of in the mood to just like browse, you know, that way. So yeah, we shall see. The interview went well, I think. Like I'm, I can't really judge these things, you know, um, but I think it went well. She basically said that she's gonna like pass on my application to, another manager and then they were gonna have a look and see like do they have kind of roles for me and stuff which is kind of what they said in yesterday's interview as well kind of similar stuff but she was more kind of like to start you here and get you here kind of thing so which I'm very okay with but she said I should know within the next 48 hours so yeah happy enough with how it went and it's such a beautiful location if i got to work there i would be so so happy but i'd also be very happy to work in the location that i interviewed at yesterday too so if just and i completely forgot i even had the interview on monday did i say this in this vlog that i had an interview on monday for a coffee shop and um it like was very weird um and i kind of forgot i had it so i haven't heard anything back and i don't mind if i don't hear anything back to be quite honest i would rather get a job in the place i interviewed yesterday or today i would really like that so done and dusted for the week. Pre interviews, finito. And I was like craving nothing for lunch. I'm like really not enjoying having to decide what I want for lunch every day. Normally at home, I just only have to do it twice. Because the other five days I was working and my lunch was made for me by the chefs. So having to like do it every single day, I'm just not enjoying. Um, and I was like sitting here and I was like, oh, it's like, I really don't want anything. And I was like, well, you have to eat meals because we need to fuel, fuel, wait till you hear I'm after ordering for lunch, like, but you know, I need to get something into me rather than not eating. So I ordered McDonald's. <laughs> I'm so bold, but you know what? I'm allowed to treat myself. No one else is treating me. So I'm going to treat myself. And I got McDonald's and I'm very excited for it. And I nearly dropped my phone. I'm gonna watch something, but I don't know what I want to watch. I might watch an episode of The Crown. I started that when the Queen died, you know, cause I was like, I'm really fascinated by the royal family. Like, let's start The Crown. And then I got a little bit tired of it. Like I'm only on season two, um, but I like flew through the first season and then the second season I've just been like, eh. 
but I might just throw on an episode of that and enjoy my McDonald's because I deserve it. You know that? I deserve it. <laughs> so I actually ended up watching Lightyear, <laughs> the Buzz Lightyear movie, because um, I'd never seen it. And then I was just like, what do I watch? Because I was so allergic to the crown. I literally put it on and I'd say I got two minutes in and it's like, oh, I can't be bothered. <laughs> so then I went to Disney Plus and saw that was there and I was like, let's watch it. And now I'm going to read for a little bit. I'm getting sleepy. And I know if I go in and sit down on my bed, I'm gonna fall asleep. So I'm gonna stay here on the couch in the hopes that I won't nap. And I'm going to read. I started reading Why Has Nobody Told Me This Before by Dr. Julie Smith. And yeah, I'm liking it. I think I'd seen it on TikTok. Um, it's more of like a like an informational one. What are they called? Nonfiction, isn't it? I don't know. It's like not one that I read going to bed anyway because I want to like ah ow ooh I have a knot there <laughs> ow ow um but I don't like reading books like this before bed because I like want to actually take in what I'm reading. Um, so yeah, gonna read some of that now. It is now the next day, it is Friday, and I actually got an email last night from the restaurant I interviewed with yesterday, and they've asked me back for another interview today. So it was really unexpected, like I literally only got it late last night, and I like panicked because I was like, crap, what am I gonna wear? I need to wash my hair, I just need to like get a few things this morning. So I've just been kind of all go all morning. Um, but this is what I'm going with today. So I have this shirt, which I'm gonna be honest, I actually have no idea where it's from. But again, it is years old. Like I said yesterday, all my shirts are so old. And then these are new pants that I got in Zara. And I have boots from Old Navy. Again, fluffy socks. Um, but yeah, I'm obviously like wasn't expecting to hear back so soon. I thought I'd have the like weekend and then they'd ask me in sometime next week, but you know it's good stuff um so yeah we'll see how today goes obviously second interview is promising um so yeah kind of like a little bit nervous but you know this is like interview number four of the week like that is so many and I literally have probably had like three interviews in my whole life um but yeah I'm excited excited I don't know am I excited? Well, I'm excited to see how it goes um, because I want to start earning money pretty soon. Um, but yeah, I'm going to leave my hair down. I wore it up yesterday and I only just washed it this morning and straightened it. So I want to leave it down and like keep it the way it is. And I think I might just leave it. I might just tuck these bits behind and maybe like throw it back like that when I'm talking to them. Um, just to try to have it over my face and I'll just leave my middle parting. Um, so yeah. I'm gonna leave in a few, I can't, the only thing about this, I can't really get at my watch. Time to let's say one minute past 12. Um, I was literally standing outside there like way too early yesterday. So I'm gonna leave um, like 10 past 12 because it does not take me that long to get there. So yeah, hopefully. They'll be like, wanna come in for a trial? And I'll be like, yep. And then they'll be like, you get the job. And I'll be like, perfect. <laughs> um, so yeah, we'll see. But hopefully it all goes well. So I got a job. Woohoo. Um, yeah, delighted. And that's that. But I am definitely gonna need to go shopping because the dress quote the dress code is quite different to my wardrobe basically um so yeah gonna need to go shopping at some point i might start looking around today i'm not totally sure um we're having another problem of just like what the hell do i have for lunch oh for now i might just chop up a banana and throw some almond butter over it and eat that i might just have that for now for a snack before i decide what i'm gonna do if i'm gonna go out Look around the shops, maybe, I'm not totally sure. The sun is... <laughs> I'm so friggin' weird. Good news today. And I don't know 
But I was just saying, really? So, I'm glad I'm doing the dishwasher. That's about it. <laughs> I literally could not make up my mind on what I wanted for lunch for ages. I decided to snacking on some, have these like chocolate covered nut things. They're really, really nice, but I just like snacked on those and I've decided I'm gonna go get myself an acai bowl. And I'm excited. I also bought a pair of jeans in Abercrombie and Fitch. They were outrageously expensive. So I think I'm gonna return them. <laughs> Because I'm just like one, I don't know, when I look at them I'm like, uh, then I put them on and I'm like, wait, they're actually nice. But they were a lot of money. And I'm like, will I return them now? Will I return them later? I don't know, but I'm going to return them and I'm going to get back my lots of money. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs>